What's up guys? I'm just leaving the gym and I just walked out like traumatized. I'm not going to lie. And that's, I wanted to share this with you. Like I was walking out, I'm like almost like in freaking shock, right? Because of how hard my leg workout was, how hard I pushed myself today. And I just want to drop this with you. Obviously when you're learning things, you're not going to be able to hit those intensity levels, right? It's going to be almost like <laughs> like physical therapy or something. It's like, okay, I got to figure out how to activate these muscles and I got to figure out the form and all that stuff. Right. But don't forget once you got it, once you got, it, you got to go, you got to push it, get to the level in your, once you've got form dialed down, like it's not always going to be this. Like I see this whole people back. They're like the, the form Nazis, the perfectionists. And they're like, and that is a perfect row. And it's like, yeah, bro, but you got to <clears throat> like, at some point you got to hit it so hard that you're almost traumatized when you get done with your set. That's how I feel. Like I have the look of disgust on my face when I get done with a set, when I push myself, it's just like, <sighs> like on the leg press today, I had three plates on each side getting full range. And when I got done, I was like, <sighs> like this, like, <sighs> mm -hmm. so just thought I'd share that with you because a lot of times, like when we're sharing workouts as trainers, like we're really, we're, I'm not usually pushing myself to that level of intensity. Cause I'm trying to make sure I show you proper form. Sometimes when you push in yourself, your form's going to fall apart a little bit. Okay. As long as it's not in like dangerous levels of form falling apart, that's going to happen when you push yourself. So that's just my message is like, when you get in your workouts, don't be afraid of that intensity. Don't run away from the intensity. The intensity is what gets you the stimulus that tells your body that it needs to adapt to be able to do that in the future. So if it's always in this, like, okay, and nine, oh yeah, I feel a burn. Okay. Yeah. It burned on. It's not just that it like burned on the last couple reps. It's like this. It's like, <sighs> Yep. <laughs> so if you're not hitting those intensity levels, you're minimizing your results. Don't hurt yourself. Okay. I don't want anybody hurting themselves. Cause I said this, make sure you got the form first, but once you do hit it. And the other thing I wanted to share is one of the fastest ways I see to destroy your gains in the gym is being on your phone and I'm guilty of it. And whenever I get in that mode, meh, my workouts suck. You've got to stay off your phone. Learn how to just sit there. You know, it's good life training in general. So you're not every single time you have a moment to yourself to just be, you're like, Oh, and I got to fill this with some crap. Like learn how to just sit there between sets. It will change the game in your workouts. I know somebody who is pretty close with Mark Sisson. You guys know Mark Sisson, the primal guy. She said he doesn't even bring his phone to the gym with him. Doesn't even bring it. He uses an iPod. <laughs> it's cause he, and he's like, I don't know how old Mark is. He looks like, I don't know, probably 60, something like that. And he's super fit. So that's the other thing is this like all the time. It's just like, I I'm guilty of it too. So I'm not judging, but when I do do that, my workouts suck and I don't get nearly as much. So I've been really mindful to not do that and just sit there. Okay. So hit those intensity levels, stay off your phone, but like, don't be afraid of it. Don't be afraid of it. I see people running from the intensity or what you think is intense is like, actually feeling something. That's just when you started to get the stimulus, but do you push yourself to the point of <sighs> that? If not, try it out, do it on something that you know, you got down, right? I don't want anybody injuring themselves, but it's got to hit those levels of intensity. I literally feel traumatized <laughs> when I'm done with a, a really good workout. So yeah, just sharing that. Okay. I gotta go. Bye guys. Thanks for joining me. Bye.